Ingushisha an introduction. Ingushisha is a republic of Russia located in the North Caucasus of Eastern Europe. The republic is part of the North Caucasian Federal District, and shares land borders with the country of Georgia and borders the Russian republics of North Ossetia, Alania and Chechnya. Its capital is the town of Margus, while the largest city is Nazran. The capital was moved from Nazran to Margus in December 2002. According to the 2021 Russian census, ethnic Ingush make up 96.4% of the republic's population. They are Sunni Muslim. Ingushisha has the highest life expectancy in all of Russia at 80.52 years, beating out second place Dagestan by almost four years. As such, Ingushisha is a Russian blue zone. Before you continue watching, please subscribe to our channel to show your support. Let's get started. Ingushisha Ingushisha or Ingushitia, officially the Republic of Ingushitia, is a republic of Russia located in the North Caucasus of Eastern Europe. The republic is part of the North Caucasian Federal District, and shares land borders with the country of Georgia to its south, and borders the Russian republics of North Ossetia Alania to its western north and Chechnya to its eastern northeast. Its capital is the town of Margus while the largest city is Nazran. The capital was moved from Nazran to Margus in December 2002. Cities under Republic's jurisdiction, as of 2016. Magosh. Magus, capital, Nazran, Nazran, Malgobek, Malgobiek, Karabulak, Karabulak, Sunza, Sunza. At 3,600 square kilometers, in terms of area, the Republic is the smallest of Russia's non-city federal subjects. It was established on the 4th of June, 1992, after the Shechino in Gush Autonomous Soviet Socialist Republic was split in totas the Republic is home to the indigenous Ingush, a people of Nak ancestry. As of the 2021 census, its population was estimated to be 509,541, 412,529, 2010 Russian census, 467,294, 2002 census. Largely due to the insurgency in the North Caucasus, Ingushisha remains one of the poorest and most unstable regions of Russia. Although the violence has died down in recent years, the insurgency in neighboring Chechnya had occasionally spilled into Ingushisha. According to Human Rights Watch in 2008, the republic has been destabilized by corruption, a number of high-profile crimes, including kidnapping and murder of civilians by government security forces, and to government protests. Attacks on soldiers and officers, Russian military excesses and a deteriorating human rights situation. In spite of this, Ingushisha has the highest life expectancy in all of Russia at 80.52 years, beating out second place Dagestan by almost four years. Etymology The name Ingushisha, Ingushitia, derives from the Russian name of the Ingush which in turn is derived from the ancient Ingush village Ingushed. Life Expectancy Ingushisha has life expectancy noticeably higher than in any other federal subjects of the Russian Federation. As such, Ingushisha is a Russian blue zone. In the pre-pandemic 2019, life expectancy in Ingushisha was the same as in Switzerland. According to estimation of WHO, 83.4 years 2019. Average 83.4 years male 80.0 years female 86.3 years 2021. 
Average 80.5 years male 77.3 years female 83.3 years. Before we continue, just a gentle reminder to like and share our videos. Also, subscribe if you haven't done to stay informed. Ethnic Groups According to the 2021 Russian Census, ethnic Ingush make up 96.4% of the Republic's population. The Ingush, a nationality group indigenous to the Caucasus, mostly inhabit Ingushisha. The Ingush speak the Ingush language, which is a very high degree of mutual intelligibility with neighboring Chechen. Other groups include Chechens, 2.5%, Russians, 0.7%, and a host of smaller groups, each accounting for less than 0.5% of the total population. Religion Ingushisha is one of the most religious regions of Russia. The Ingush people predominantly follow the Shafi'i Madhab of Sunni Islam with strong influence from Sufism, which is often associated with one of two traditional Sufi orders, the Sufi Tariq and Akshbandi. Represented in Ingushisha by the Brotherhood of Deni Arsenov, and the Tariq Akadari Iyer, associated with Kunta Haji Kishiv. Education Ingush State University, the first institute of higher education in the history of Ingushisha, was founded in 1994 in Ordzolikadzevskaya. Geography Ingushisha is situated on the northern slopes of the Caucasus. Its area is reported by various sources as either 2,000 square kilometers or 3,600 square kilometers. The difference in reporting is mainly due to the inclusion or exclusion of parts of Sunzinski districts. The Republic borders North Ossetia Alania, Southwest West Northwest North, the Chechnya Northeast East Southeast, and the country of Georgia Mtskhet and Shyaniti, southwards. The highest point is the Gora Shan, 4,451 meters. A 150-kilometer stretch of the Caucasus Mountains runs through the territory of the Republic. Rivers Major rivers include, Terek River Asa River Sansa River. Natural Resources Ingushisha is rich in marble, timber, dolomite, plaster, limestone, gravel, granite, clay, thermal medical water, rare metals, mineral water, oil, over 60 billion tons, and natural gas reserves. Climate Ingushisha's climate is mostly continental with average January temperature of minus 10 degrees Celsius, average July temperature of 21 degrees Celsius and an average annual temperature of plus 10 degrees Celsius. The average annual precipitation is between 450-650 mm. Economy there are some natural resources in Ingushisha, mineral water in Achaluki, oil and natural gas in Malgobek, forests in Zhirak, metals in Galashki. The local government is considering the development of tourism, however, this is problematic due to the uneasy situation in the Republic itself and the proximity of some conflict zones. However, Ingushisha continues to remain as one of Russia's poorest republics largely due to the ongoing conflict, corruption and civil disorders. Unemployment is estimated to be around 53%, and growing poverty is a major issue. Share your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel to show your support.